Okay. Welcome back. Greetings for the day, dear children. Welcome back to the second part of this video. So over here, we all were discussing about how a globe as well as a map work. Now, dear children, we can find all the countries. Okay, we can find the continents. We can find uh, the water bodies. But can we find in general cities like Vasai, Virar, Mumbai, Churchgate? No, for that we require a map. However, the lines represent okay only on the globe. Whereas in the real earth, on our real planet. There's nothing like these lines. Okay, these lines are imaginary lines. Now, when we talk about the map of our country, so instead of purchasing a map, I had suggested you you can just try it on your Google map. It's there on every phone. So when we talk about uh, which map would we require, we would be requiring first the map of Maharashtra. And after that, if you want uh, a much more precise detail, so we can also do it on the map of Vasai Virar. Okay. Now, have you been to a, any other state? If yes, you can write it down. Shan Mir thinks that there are lines drawn on the ground between the states. Okay, dear children, again, all these are imaginary lines. Okay. So, abhi grounds ke jaga, wo lines ke jaga, we have border. From one country to different country, if we wish to travel, we have to follow certain procedures. We need certain documents. However, when Madam Sunita saw uh, the earth from space, she found the earth very beautiful. However, one can only make out the land and sea. One cannot see the different countries. Now, let us talk about the phases of moon. As we have already studied about gravitational force and uh, about the earth and how the lines are imaginary, I also we understood the difference between the globe as well as the map. However, when we talk about moon, my dear children, it is quite unfortunate that where we live, our area, okay, is quite polluted and as a result, we may not get the actual view of the stars okay so my dear children if you are in your native place you can have a clearer view however if not you can go out of your building or from you can have a look from your window but be careful if you are near the window okay do not jump on your grill or uh, do not uh, jump on the uh, way towards the window just be careful do not jump basically just have a look Okay, when you observe your, uh, observe our uh, moon, okay, what happens is, dear children, you will find that its shape keeps on changing. And this process, this phases of moon is continuous in nature, okay, it is continuous in nature. So, what are the phases of moon? Let us study in great detail. My dear children, we are already aware, we are already aware that, moon keeps on changing so why does it keep on changing what is the reason behind it so my dear children moon has eight faces moon has eight faces some night the moon might look like a narrow crescent so first we must understand what is crescent what is waxing what is uh, waning my dear children, waxing means growing larger, growing bigger. When we talk about this eight, uh, eight phases, the first one, okay, it is new moon. So when we talk about new moon, we cannot see the moon, okay, when you know, uh, very lightly or maybe it is very impossible to see the moon. So that is known as new moon, okay. When we talk about waxing crescent, what happens is, a very thin line, a very thin line in this shape can be seen. Okay? First quarter, first quarter is, you know, we see 50%. 50% of moon can be seen and the other part is still in the dark. Here children, this means that the moon is gone. The moon is It is just the light that matters. Okay? 
आप फोटोज लेते हो तो कैसे एट सर्टेन एंगल्स लाइट रहेगा तो योर फेस में ऑल्सो ग्लो योर फेस में शाइन बट अगर लाइट नहीं होता है तो कैसे डार्क फोटोज आते हैं या कितनी बार अगर आप अंधेरे में फोटो लोगे विदाउट फ्लैश लाइट तो आपको पूरा ब्लैक ब्लैक दिखेगा वैसे ही यहाँ पर भी वैसा ही हो रहा है इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ द लाइट यू कैन सी दिस वी सी दर्स्ट क्वार्टर फेस एज हाफ मून इसको हाफ बिकॉज हाफ पार्ट यू कैन सी एंड हाफ पार्ट यू कैन नॉट सी वेन वी टॉक अबाउट वैक्सीन गिबिस इट मीन्स दैट This process is between half a moon, between the first quarter and the full moon. Waxing means going bigger, bigger, bigger. Waxing means growing larger. Then finally, we have the full moon. Full moon. That means we can see the entire moon illuminated. When we talk about waning gibbous, waning. Okay, it means getting smaller. छोटा छोटा होते जाना देन वी हैव दर्ड क्वार्टर इन दर्ड क्वार्टर वी कैन सी हाफ मून ओके वी कैन सी हाफ मून इट इज एक्सैक्टली अपोजिट ऑफ द फर्स्ट क्वार्टर एक्सैक्टली अपोजिट ठीक है देन वेन वी हैव दिनिंग क्रिसेंट वेन वी हैव वेनिंग क्रिसेंट अगेन अ वेरी थिन लाइन ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड ऑफ द मून वेरी थिन लाइन So, my dear children, the moon displays all these eight faces, one after the other, one after the other. Okay. So, dear children, uh, you can also search some real life images. And why to search? You can observe. Teacher has already asked you all to observe, note it in your diary, or you can take take photographs. Okay, every day for a month, and then you can find. You can make a folder of those. Uh, one month file and you can also observe the changes on your own also it is possible that when you click photos you won't get the clear view so you can draw it in rough in your you know in rough you can just sketch it in your ears notebook try doing this for a month and you will be getting to experience this first hand now when is the next full moon at what time will the moon rise on this day what does moon Look like on this day. So, dear children, try doing this to find out this. You'll have to try the experiment. What are the festivals related to moon? So, we have Eid, which is related to moon. At night, look at the sky carefully for five minutes, dear children. This also helps us to relax. When you do this activity, it is going to relax you. from all the stress if you have been going through something it is going to be very relaxing so look at the sky carefully for 5 minutes dear children now you are supposed to find out okay on 28th october the moon came out at dash minutes past dash o'clock so when we talk about time of the moon rising now 19 hour 16 minutes means 7 it is 7 pm and 16 minutes it is 7:16 okay in the evening now there is something time of moon set dear children it is early in the morning 8:15 oh my god it is 10 o'clock 11 o'clock and around noon dear children can we see the moon in the daylight it is because of the sun the sun rays cover the moon however there are certain exceptions jahan pe aapko moon din mein bhi aapne definitely witness kiya hoga on 20th october the moon came out at dash dash minutes so dear children 16 minutes past dash o'clock so 7 o'clock 29th october try out on your own hmm? if you saw the moon rising at 7 pm today would you see it the same time tomorrow dear children moon is not going to school that moon will uh, definitely you know come at the perfect time and moon will not uh, you know rise up late because moon will get late remark aisa nahi hai okay it basically depends every uh, you know different timing different days it depends okay it cannot be the same punctual because it's a moon it is not a human being on 31st october the time of setting 
of the moon is given as uh, giving given as 12 3 have you ever seen a moon at 12 okay the sunlight dominates but however again i am saying however there are certain exceptions because hum sab ne din mein kabhi na kabhi to moon dekha hi hai theek hai now there are these two poetries twinkling stars when we talk about this twinkling stars what do you think these uh, you know poetry is asking us just go through the poetry this poem is asking us why uh, does the star twinkle why does the star twinkle does each and every star have a name what do you think and how do star shine so bright and why do they hide in the morning some shining stars we know so well but every star has a tale to tell and also you know successful people are known as rising star they are known as star so why is it so dear children dear children uh you you know i'll give you a very small explanation the light okay coming out from the star theek hai star ke paas jo light hoti hai dear children wo atmosphere se pass hoti hai ab atmosphere also has different layers ye aap higher classes mein study karenge and hamare atmosphere ke layers ke wajah se kya ho raha hai wo stars shine ho rahe hain ठीक है और के एटमॉस्फेयर के वजह से स्टार्स का जो लाइट है वो उस वजह से शाइन होता है children i want you to find out something do stars twinkle in space space se humne stars ko dekha to stars twinkle karenge yes or no why yes why no i want you to think about it theek hai because of atmosphere na atmosphere is your hint now there is an interesting photograph a space ship went to the moon this photograph of the earth was clipped So how the Earth is looking? Can you see the surface of the Moon? Do you have some questions? What are your questions? Now this part we are going to start in our next uh, part of the video, my dear children. So take care, stay home, and stay safe.